Good afternoon, folks. Back with another great technique. Today we're working on twist kick. Now it's a little bit more of an advanced kicking technique, but it's very useful, especially for point sparring, to do something kind of sneaky that no one's expecting and still score a point. Now, let's take a look at what twist kick looks like and then we'll break it down into its pieces. Basically, twist kick is going to start out just like a front kick. And that's why it's so sneaky. You don't know if it's going to be a front kick or a roundhouse kick or a twist kick. And no one's expecting that one. <laughs> They're thinking it's going to be a front kick or a roundhouse kick. Those are your bread and butter techniques. But the twist kick is like a little wild surprise that no one's really expecting. And that's why it does tend to score a lot. Now the key to generating power with the twist kick is another uh, challenge altogether. It does have some power. It's more of like, you know, a light stunning power. I wouldn't say it's going to be your knockout kick, although it's delivered to the head and it can be delivered quite high. Okay. Could have some significant power, but the key with the power is you're going to want to use your back leg. If you use your back leg with an outside crescent kick or twist kick or any kind of outward mo moving motion, it's going to be a lot easier because you have more momentum to come through and you're able to open your hips up much more. And it's really that opening of your hips that generates the power. So you bring your knee up, you kick out, and then you push out with your hip. That's how you're going to get that power. The pushing out with your hip. Okay. Now twist kick can be done with your back leg, all right? But it can also be done with your lead leg, okay? Just right away from here, this way, okay? And it can be pretty sneaky. You know, a good combination, can you put that down, sir, just so quick? Hands up like this. You know, a good combination could be, actually, uh, let's switch our feet. Yes, sir. So people can see a little better. Yes. Could be a back fist to the face to raise his hand up, and then a twist kick underneath the body. No one's going to expect that, and it's a, a clear point. Okay. So like I said, twist kick is a little bit more of a point uh, sparring technique, but it's very sneaky, fun to learn, and people will be like kind of scratching their head when they see you do it. So that adds to its uh, excitement and intrigue. Anyway, that's twist kick, pretty simple. Why don't we get to work practicing?